Understanding Issuer Identification Numbers, IIN. In the realm of payment cards, understanding the technical aspects can greatly enhance your knowledge of how transactions are processed. One crucial component involved is the issuer identification number, IN, which plays a foundational role in the card transaction process. What is an issuer identification number, IIN? The issuer identification number, often referred to as the bank identification number, BIN, is a unique sequence of digits found on payment cards, such as credit, debit, and prepaid cards. The IIN helps identify the institution that issued the card, as well as the specific card processing network involved, such as Visa or MasterCard. Key Features Location The IIN is located at the beginning of the payment card number, typically made up of the first six or eight digits. Authentication Following the IIN are additional digits that pertain specifically to the cardholder, culminating in a final check digit used for verifying the authenticity of the entire card number. Length the entire card number can range from 15 to 19 digits. The IIN itself generally consists of 6 to 8 digits, a standard established by the International Organization for Standardization, ISO. Breakdown of the Issuer Identification Number Major Industry Identifier, MII The first digit of the IIN is called the Major Industry Identifier, MII. It categorizes the card into various industries based on standards set by ISO IEC 7812. For financial cards, typical starting digits are 3. Travel and Entertainment, e.g., American Express. 4. Visa. 5. MasterCard. 6. Discover. 7. Fuel. 1 and 2. Airline Industry. This specific numbering system allows for immediate identification of the sector and potential issuer associated with the card. Issuer Info The remaining digits in the IIN, whether they are 5 or 7, in addition to the leading 1 or 3 digits, specify the issuing bank or financial institution. Over the years, as the number of cards has expanded, newer IINs have transitioned to 8 digits to meet the growing demand. Unique card numbers and check digits. After the IIN, the card number contains a unique string of digits assigned to the individual cardholder. The last digit is known as the check digit, which is validated using the LUN algorithm. This algorithm ensures the accuracy of the number you entered during a transaction. Significance of issuer identification numbers. Instantaneous verification. The presence of IINs facilitates real-time validation of card authenticity and availability of funds. Merchants and payment processors rely on this information to approve or decline transactions almost instantaneously. This rapid process is essential in today's fast-paced digital purchasing environment. Distinction between card number and account number It's important to differentiate between your credit card number and your account number. The printed card number can change if the card is lost or stolen, while the actual account number associated with your financial institution typically remains the same. You can usually find your account number on your monthly statement from the issuer. Additional Card Security Features CVV Code Additionally, another security feature included on cards is the CVV Code, card verification value, typically a three- or four-digit number. This provides an extra layer of security in card not present transactions, helping to prevent fraud by ensuring that the transaction is performed by someone in possession of the physical card. Truncation Rules for Receipts Under the Federal Fair and Accurate Credit Transactions Act, FACTA, merchants must not print full card numbers on receipts. This truncation policy requires that only the last five digits of any card number be displayed, protecting customers from identity theft. Virtual credit card numbers Increasingly, consumers are utilizing virtual credit card numbers that are separate from their main card number but linked to the same account. These disposable or single-use numbers are particularly favored for online shopping, mitigating risks related to card information theft. Authorized users Lastly, 
It's worth noting that authorized users on a credit card account may receive a card with either the same or different number, depending on the issuer. However, the account holder remains responsible for debts incurred by authorized users. Conclusion The issuer identification number, IAN, provides essential information regarding a payment card, revealing the issuing bank and the specific card processing network. Understanding the structure and function of the IIN enhances our comprehension of how payment card transactions operate and safeguards against fraud. With the continuous evolution of card security measures and the vast number of payment cards in circulation, awareness of the IIN becomes increasingly vital for consumers, merchants, and financial institutions alike.